When I'm looking for a surgeon, I want somebody who has never operated before in his life. His approach will be fresh and new. And using that same logic, it makes a lot of sense to cast your vote for Meg Whitman, the candidate unburdened by experience. Schwarzenegger was a political novice, and he was such a great success. That we should support a candidate whose background is even less. So following this logic, why sit on the fence? Cast your vote for Meg Whitman, the candidate unburdened by experience. I'm sure she'll be a great governor, Cause it's been duly noted Not only has she not held political office She's, she's hardly, hardly ever voted So following this logic It would be really clever To, to cast, cast your vote for Meg Whitman Who's had no political involvement whatsoever Everyone's gotta start somewhere To politically participate so why not start by becoming the governor of the largest state? I'm sure it's not a problem for learning at our expense. So cast your vote for Meg Whitman, the candidate unburdened by experience. I know she'll be victorious, and here's the reason why. She will win all the votes that, that her millions and millions can buy. We've all seen the ads she's bought with her fortune that's so immense. So cast your vote for Meg Whitman, even though she has no experience. Run government like a business, that's, that's the song she'll sing. But government is not like a business. It's its own thing. So we've begun to wonder if it makes a lot of sense to cast your vote for Meg Whitman, the candidate lacking in experience. The candidate.